as fans of the Fast and Furious series know, Luke Hobbs was once trying to hunt down Dom and his crew. But now that he's joined them in their thrilling escapades, he's been driving trucks and large vehicles to help Dom and his crew out. He's driven a Gurkha LAPV, a Navistar MXT, an ambulance, and he's going to drive a Dodge Ram modified for snow travel. But what kinds of vehicles can he drive next? Well, I have comprised a list of the top five vehicles that I would like to see Hobbs drive in the future. What will they be? Let's find out. Number five, a semi-truck. Now, we've already seen big rigs in the hands of the bad guys before, but Hobbs could easily smash into a building or an enemy car that came his way behind the wheel of a Mack or a Peterbilt. However, as we all know, semi-trucks are pretty standard. So, with the truck alone, there's not much he could do. Now, if he had a trailer behind him, he could probably cause even more damage. Number four, a tow truck. Hobbs could do the same thing that he could with a semi-truck in a tow truck or a rotator, but now he's got an added bonus, a hook. Stick a wrecking ball on there or a big hook instead and BAM! Bad guy's gone! The hook on the truck could also be useful in a heist, carrying something valuable such as a safe within ropes or chains. Heck, he could even latch onto a car in the middle of combat if he wanted. That would be pretty sweet to see. Number three. What's more fun than a truck? A striker. This thing is bulletproof and could blow cars to pieces with its mounted gun. Or at least, I think it can. Or at least Fast and Furious can make it do that. This vehicle is just calling for Hobbs to drive it. I mean, look at it. It's terrifying. If Dom's crew had Hobbs behind the wheel of this thing, bad guys would be running. Hobbs has driven his fair share of armored vehicles as we've seen before, but this would be awesome. Number two, the Avtaro Shaman 8x8. Now this thing doesn't have weapons or speed, but what does it have? Eight wheel drive, that's what. This truck is known for going over all kinds of terrain without any problems, such as thick mud and snow. It could even drive through a lake at certain depths if it wanted. If Hobbs drove one of these, it would be so awesome. Bad guys would be wondering, what the hell is that thing? And then BAM! Their car's crushed. But there's only one thing that would be better than this. And it might sound a little bizarre, but it would be totally worth to see. But first, an honorable mention. A monster truck. Yeah. A fire engine. Now I know what you guys are thinking. How the hell is this more interesting than that eight wheel truck or hell, even a monster truck? How is a fire engine better? Tell me. Well, let me start off with this. We've already seen police cars being driven by Dom's crew, and Hobbs actually drove an ambulance in Furious 7. So why not round out the emergency vehicles and give him a fire engine? He could knock stuff out of the way with ease like all the other vehicles on this list. Plus, some fire engines can spray water. Imagine Hobbs doing that to enemy cars, blowing them back with a streaming jet of defeat. One fire engine that I would definitely recommend Hobbs drive is the Rosenbauer Panther. It's huge and looks very menacing despite being built for rescue purposes. Heck, Sentinel Prime for Transformers 3 turned into one of these, and he was the main villain. That's all I have for today. What vehicles do you want to see Hobbs drive? Leave a comment below and like this video. I have at least one more list coming related to Fast and Furious. So definitely be on the lookout for that. If you want to know when it's coming, feel free to subscribe. This is JokerFan45 signing off. I'll see you around.